When you think of women's fashion during the Civil War, odds are you envision big showy dresses draped over the iconic hoop skirts. It took at least five yards of fabric to make one dress, and wealthy women like most of the Nancy Hearts could easily change three times a day. They wore a morning dress, a walking dress, an evening dress, a Sunday dress, and as the war progressed, a dress to mourn their loved ones. So when it came time to confront the Yankees on April 17, 1865, the very practical Southern ladies of LaGrange, Georgia were prepared. The day that they marched, not sure whether they could save their homes, they put on every dress that they could out of their wardrobes. In fact, Adelia Bull is one who gives us this story in the 1880s in a newspaper article. She actually stated that they probably uh, had assumed false Staffian proportions because they had put on so many dresses. I've often wondered about that, whether a bullet would have even penetrated if they had on as many dresses as they seemed to think they had on, seven to 10 of those big hoop skirts. not convinced that they would save their homes because of the stories they'd heard the year before. They put on every dress they could just so they'd still have something to wear even if they were burned out of house and home. <laughs> 